gems welcome back to my channel again so if you watched the previous video you know what this video is all about but if you haven't go check it out however if you're here because you're not interested in that previous video <laughs> that's cool too um, but this video is all about me finally introducing to you the business that I am starting so I finally got my logo I am going to try and put it somewhere on the screen I will put the link to the person who did my logo in my description box below if you're interested in getting her up for any work of your own in terms of a logo or business card designs or whatever so that's my logo so as you can see the name of my business is going to be gems holistic let me tell you guys how I came up with the name for those of you who don't know my very very close friends call me Ja my name is Jahila but they call me Ja my fiance calls me Empress I can't tell you the last time I've heard him call me by my actual name. All when we upset with each other arguing, he still calls me Empress. Like that's just my name for him. That is why my Instagram handle is Ja Empress. It's just two of my, I guess, nicknames together. So when I was coming up with what my business name would be, I was, I was just basically brainstorming and I was like, Gem, Gem Holistic, Gems Holistic. And Gem, it was just kind of me putting Ja and Empress together, the J from Ja and E-M from Empress press and then I am also a Gemini <laughs> <laughs> this may be corny to some of you guys but listen okay it makes sense to me so <laughs> I was like gem gem as in Gemini gem as in something precious a jewel gemstones it all fits because at the end of the day aren't we all gems and that is why I always say hey gems because we're all gemstones we're all something precious and valuable to ourselves to other people and that's pretty much the meaning behind the name of my business is that it's something of value, something to cherish, something to hold to high standards. So Gems Holistic is going to be a natural skincare product line. So if you know me, like really, really know me, you know I'm always doing some kind of DIY something in my kitchen, whether it is body butters, lip balms, stuff on my hair, it doesn't matter. I'm always doing some kind of DIY something. And although I don't have a lot of DIYs on my channel, like I've been doing DIYs for years. I was back in college in my dorm room making lip balms. Who does that? I do. Or when I was living home in my parents' house, like I was always coming up with some kind of hair mask recipe. I was whipping up body butters for years. It's always been like a little hobby of mine. And when I was trying to come up with a business idea, I was like, what do I love to do that I can do for money, that I can make profitable? And I started thinking and thinking. I was like, I am so big on natural products so big on it I spend tons of money on it because I rather buy something that's toxic free and as natural as possible to put on my skin and hair than to buy something that's cheap and full of chemicals and toxics that's basically gonna enter into my pores and enter my body anyways so part of me li living a healthy and vegan lifestyle has a big part of what I put on my skin as well so that is why I'm very 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 particular as to what I buy in terms of what I put on my hair and on my skin and I was like I already have a passion for it so why not do it beyond just a hobby so I started doing research and I when I say research I mean research I bought books y'all like let me let me show you yeah I bought books I've watched tons and tons of videos I read tons of articles. I'm still learning. However, I'm learning as I go. And I decided that my natural product line is going to start off with handcrafted cold process bar soaps, body butters, because who doesn't love a good body butter, and body scrubs. And I want it to be different. Like, I didn't want to be just um, someone whipping something up that isn't of substance and has no benefits. So I really, really did my research. Like I bought, I bought three books on cold process soap making. I've read through all of them. I bought books, and I still have more books in my cart because, like, I feel like you can always learn more. I'm forever learning, forever growing in everything I do, and this is just another thing. So I am actually going to be inserting clips because <laughs> it's been a journey, y'all. Like for the past few months, I've basically been creating recipes 
creating formulas and testing them out making small batches tweaking them remaking batches like it's a process but i don't feel like it's work when i'm making a batch of soap i'm i'm good i'm at ease i'm just doing my thing even when i mess up or do something wrong or make a mistake like it's not stressful it's just like okay let me find out how i can fix this and that's pretty much what i've been doing literally since i got back from st croix january 12th i came back i was like okay this is what i'm gonna do i decided that my tax refund this year i'm just gonna invest it and go all in for this business so that's what i did and i'll probably insert some clips of the all of my supplies that i've been ordering and you know all of my natural oils and butters like it's the investment like for some people they need a good 20 grand 15 grand just to start a business as a startup but for this i'm not saying that i need that much or have spent that much i have not at all but it still takes money and i'm doing this with my own money the little that i have and the little that i'm making so i took my tax refund Fun and I ordered bulk of everything. I finally started getting my supplies. Funny story, I thought these jars came with covers. It doesn't. You gotta order the um, cover separate, so now I have to wait for the covers to reach. Please. But it's cool. I'm so excited. <laughs> bulk oils, bulk butters, I bought um, all of my soap molds, um, containers, bowls, my stick blender, like every, all the supplies that I needed to make whole process soap and body butters and body scrubs. I bought all the supplies. I did my research. Um, it was intense, but I did it. I remember the day after I received all of my bulk oils and supplies, like I had this down feeling like, what did I just do? Did I really just spend all that money on this stuff? I'm tripping. Why do I think I can do this? There's so many other people doing this. Why do I think that I can just come into this field and do this and I felt really really down and literally the next day I got a text well I got a message on messenger from a girl I know from back home asking me to make her some body butter <laughs> and that she would pay me and it's just so ironic that she did that at that moment not even knowing that I wanted that I was in the process of starting this business so she not knowing anything just contact me and ask me to make her some just based on a um, video I have on my channel of me making my own body butter and she had a special request to add like aloe vera gel to her um, batch so I was like yeah I can do that and my confidence immediately boosted. I got into my kitchen I was excited I whipped up this body butter and it was literally one of the best batches that I ever made um, I kept some from I made enough for myself as well because I was running low anyways and when she got it she loved it like the thing with that is that I told her to be completely honest with me like let me know how I can make it better she messaged me saying she loved it her skin feels great her skin is glowing anyway the cold process soaps I made batch after batch after batch and I'm going to insert clips I actually record videos of me making my first batch of each soap that I'm gonna have on my product line um, and they all came out really good like I created these recipes from scratch just based on my research I tweaked them um, basically put my own twist on them so that they're uniquely mine and it's not a copy of some other the recipe that I saw but I wanted to make every single recipe my own so I made sure of that um, the soaps that I have so far are my signature soap is going to be called sacred gem and it's a turmeric and honey soap scented with lavender and orange essential oil and so far that has been my big sell biggest seller and yes I've been selling soap already I've been selling it like well my fiance has been selling it for me he's way more social than I am when he's ready or when he has to be I should 
should say. I have packaged in everything for my soaps. The only thing I don't have yet is the labels. Now that I finally have my logos, I just started designing my labels. So this next batch of soap that I'm making will be even more official because it'll have my labels on it. Listen, y'all, throughout this video, you're probably seeing clips of different things. So um, you'll be seeing for yourself what I'm talking about. So yeah, I'm starting off with full process bar soaps, body butters, body scrubs, and I'm also going to be doing lip balm soon. And then as I get started and start like generating sales, have my website up and generating sales, I'm going to add face products to it. So I'm going to have face wash, face scrub, face moisturizing cream toner and face mask that's the next five products I'm gonna add to my line so I'm not just gonna be the cold process so body butters and body scrub like that's just what I'm launching with because I find it to be better to launch with something small versus have all these 10 12 20 products and can't keep up or don't have the means to make all of them and trying to put myself into debt trying to make and buy the ingredients for all of these products so i'm starting simple to get myself going and to basically raise enough money to do my website i don't have my website yet but that's the next thing i'm going to be working on but i want it to be legit i want it to be able to people to be able to go on and order no matter where in the world they are i'm not just trying to be local i want my product to be accessible to everyone everywhere so that's why i'm going to be doing my own website i've considered starting to sell on etsy and um i'm still thinking about that one i may start on etsy i don't know yet however right now i'm just i have just been selling it local and that is the purpose of this video to put myself out there and let you guys know what i have um honestly my first set of soaps that i've made they're almost all sold out i probably have have a few of each kind left except for the turmeric the turmeric is completely gone it's sold completely out but um i have a few of each of my body butters so my body butters are going to be a creamy mango body butter a shade creamy shade aloe body butter and then i have a royal rose body butter a lavender body butter shea hemp and my signature body butter is gonna call be called sacred gem body butter which will be in um scented with jasmine and ylang ylang essential oil as well as have a little bit of turmeric in it just for added benefits and that one has like four different butters in it it's gonna be the only one with four butters it'll have shea butter mango butter cocoa butter and cocoa butter so i'm gonna have all of this stuff listed on the screen just to make it easy and um Oh, did I finish naming my soaps? So yeah, I have my signature soap called Sacred Gem Turmeric and Honey. I have a Shea Aloe soap scented with lemongrass and eucalyptus essential oil. I have a Shea Hemp soap scented with sandalwood and cedarwood. Then I have a coconut charcoal soap scented with a natural coconut fragrance oil. I have a coconut almond soap and a charcoal tea tree soap. So those are the six soaps I'm starting off with. And then once I get started, every month Month, I'm gonna make a specialty soap. So my specialty soap is gonna be a batch of a soap that I've never made before that once that's gone that's it it's not coming back and I'm gonna record myself making that every month so that you guys can see the process. I feel like that's what's going to set me apart too is that I'm actually going to be sharing my journey with you guys. Like you guys are gonna have a look inside of my business to see how the products are being made, what are being put into them because there's a lot of natural product companies that out here that are claiming to have natural products but there's tons of crap in their products and I think that's what's gonna set me apart because I feel like there's so much little natural product companies out there selling natural soaps and body butters and stuff why do I think I can do this there's a lot of competition out there and they have five ten years ahead of me but I cannot let that stop me. Like like I said, I cannot let fear stop me anymore. I cannot keep convincing myself out of doing things that I want to do. So I'm just putting myself out there. I'm taking a leap. I'm taking risks. And there's no other way to live. You just got to put yourself out there and take the risks. Because 10 years from now, I do not want to be looking back and be like, if I had started this, if I had really do this, I would be so far by now. So I'm starting this little business. And although I don't have my website up yet um you guys can still order things from me by 
hitting me up on my Instagram page. I'm, I am going to make an Instagram page for my business called Gems Holistic. But what I'm going to do is, if you guys know, I do have two Instagram pages. I have my personal one where I share my yoga journey. Well, where it's mostly sharing my yoga journey called Ja underscore Empress underscore. And then I have this next page that I created for my YouTube channel called Ja Empress underscore YT for YouTube. I'm actually going to turn that page into my business page because it's already set up like a business page. So I'm just going to change the name to Gem Holistic because let's be honest here. I could barely keep up with two different Instagrams. There's no way I'm going to keep up with three. <laughs> so that's going to be my business page. I'm going to make a Facebook business page and then I'll be sharing things on this YouTube channel because I'm not, I'm not creating a, a second YouTube channel right now. It's not necessary. I am not that big to be having two different YouTube channels. So I'll be sharing things pertaining to my business on here as well as on my business page of Instagram and my Facebook page. So you guys can hit me up on any of those platforms. I'll also have my business email address in the description box below. So if you wanted to order some soap or body butters or body scrubs, you guys can do that by hitting me up. And um, I also will take special orders. Like if you want a body butter formulated based on oils or butters you want in it you can hit me up and just let me know once i already have the oil or butter in stock i can make that for you special order and it will be a small special order fee but it would be formulated just for you scented with whatever scent you want all of the information for that would be in the description box in terms of how to contact me and all of this is just temporary because like i said my next step is getting my website i was actually going to wait until my website was up to even put my business out there but my fiance was like that's not a good idea like just put yourself out there and let people see you grow i am already starting to remake these soaps because like I said they're the first batch that I made are selling out the crazy thing about it is that Kopasa soap has a cure time of four to six weeks so these batches of soaps that I'm making now will not be available until the end of May anyways so yeah gems holistic my slogan is treat your body like the gem it is and I love the slogan treat your body like the gem it is Gem in the slogan is actually spelled G-E-M because of the actual meaning of the word. They just have to be cut in the grass right now. I hope you guys can hear me. But yeah, my slogan is treat your body like the gem it is because I truly, truly believe that you should treat your body like a gem. Your body is literally a temple and what you put on it goes in it. Our skin is the lar largest organ on our body. and although people think that you're just it's not going in your body it is it goes through your pores so all of the toxic lotions and soaps and deodorants and everything that you you're using for years on top of years all of those toxic ingredients are going into your skin and then we wonder why we have issues um, why are we getting um, breast cancer the deodorant you're using you've been using for years is full of crap we're putting crap on our body we're putting crap in our body we're using crappy feminine products in terms of pads and tam tampons and so forth like where you we're putting so much crap on and in our body that of course we're gonna get these health issues and so forth and I'm not trying to sound like any doctor because I'm not because there's tons of other causes so my camera stopped recording at some point I'm not sure where it stopped recording so this is just the introduction of my business Gems Holistic providing natural skin care and in the future hopefully hair care as well like I said hit me up if you want to make any special orders or if you want to purchase any soaps body butters body scrubs lip balms all of the information is in the description box below and I just want to talk about this real quick in terms of pricing when I was thinking about starting this I was very on the I was on the fence about how much I would charge people for my products and I'm being very frank right now because I just want to be transparent throughout this whole process. I buy natural products all the time and I don't mind paying the price for it because it's important to me to put natural products on my skin and in my hair. In terms of my hair products, I always try to get that on sale and that's because I'm a low-key hair product junkie and I have way more than I need. If I'm going to keep buying hair products, I need to not always 
buy them at the full price and that's why i always try to save some coins on my hair products but when it comes to my skincare products like i buy that when i need it and i spend nine times out of ten full price for it and i don't mind that because it's important for me to put natural products on my skin i haven't bought natural pro i haven't bought skin products in a while now that i'm really making my own on a consistent basis but i'm just saying that like a lot of people prefer not to because of the price however it's just basically what your priority is and what's important to you so what's important to me is putting natural and toxic free in, um, products on my skin in here but for other people they might spend a hundred bucks on a on a name brand bag and them name brand bags more than a hundred dollars so i'm just being nice with that price but i would never spend that much money on a bag I don't care if my bag is a knockoff. I don't care if my bag is from Ross or Marshalls. Those stuff don't phase me. But I would spend $15 on some body butter or $10 on a natural bar of soap. And I'm just throwing prices out there. So I was on the fence in terms of how much would I charge for my products because I really want to get more of people like me to buy natural skincare products without saying shit. That no man, that's that's too expensive. I, I really sat down like I have a whole spreadsheet <laughs> and this is I guess where my accounting background comes into play and I literally break down the cost of every single ingredient in my products by ounce and gram so the cost per ounce and the cost per gram and I come up with how much it costs me to make each batch of my products and then I price it based on that so I'm not pricing my products by just throwing a price on it I am literally finding out what it costs me to make it and then pricing it so that I can at least make a profit so I'm not somebody that's coming out there to sell you overpriced products however I am using quality natural organic ingredients so to give you the best quality products so based on my cost I have to price it where I can still make a profit and I think that's something that we forget a lot even for people will go out and buy a shirt for $25 one like a simple shirt with a print on it from uh, somebody that's selling making and selling shirts for $25 now I don't know how they came up with that price but I know it's $25 and when you're a small business or somebody just hustling trying to make some money at the end of the day you want to make a profit so you have to price your products in order to make a profit now some people might go and support somebody that's selling 25 30 dollar shirts but won't support somebody that's selling natural handmade products because they think that's too expensive but a 30 dollar shirt isn't so it's all about priority and um, what's important to you so if you do decide to support me just know that i'm not out here to overcharge people and i've done my research i've really done like there are people out here selling you four ounces of body butter for 25 dollars, and i think that's ridiculous no matter how natural or organic your your oils and butters are like a four ounce bottle for $25 is pretty insane and I've been reading um, ingredients for months like I've just been looking up different natural product companies reading ingredients seeing their prices and like because I really really want to have my products priced at a fair price I don't want to overcharge anybody for anything so just know that uh, I am launching with the intentions to attract more of us into that natural world so anyways let me wrap up this video again gems holistic is coming to a website near you <laughs> soon but right now follow us on instagram facebook follow my personal instagram you can follow my snapchat i'm gonna start posting stuff on there as well all of the information is in the description box below the email address everything so contact me for your natural skin products and just know gems holistic is on its way gems holistic is on its way and treat your body like the gem it is because we're all gemstones right anyways i am so corny don't forget to like comment and subscribe share this video i don't really ask you guys to share videos but share this video to your friends your family everyone because I really, really, really want to get this out there. And I really, I'm really putting my all into this. And I'm really passionate about this. So, yeah. Share this video with everybody. Spread the word. Gem Solistic. And my website will be coming soon. Watch me grow on this journey. Watch me 
take this hobby into a business and I hope this inspires you to do the same to whatever your hobby is or anything that you've been wanting to do but too afraid to. So hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you, well you will see me in my next one. Peace. And you deserve it all, oh, this is perfect And it's the magic and everything you do Is it not nerds, perfect dance The sun is missing and everything